many things I've got to tell you, but I'm afraid I don't know how. Cause there's a possibility that you look at me differently, love. Ever since the first moment I spoke your name, for then on. Hey besties, welcome back to yet another video with your girl, Anisha Miracle. Let's get straight into today's video. Um, It is currently 10.50 a.m. and I've been up pretty early. I did my hair and I filmed a video for TikTok, Instagram, shorts, all of that because, you know, we repurpose. I'm going to upload that video. I'm going to insert it right after. I just have to get ready for work so I'm about to get ready for work I'm so obsessed with my hair like I love it I need to record the end video of my hair now that it's like pretty much 95% night I'm gonna say like 98% dry so I'm gonna record that after I get dressed for work right now if we just do some skincare a little bit I need to put some moisturizer on my face that's it I've eaten breakfast I did my hair and now I'm going to take y'all along with me for my day. Um, I'm not really sure what this vlog is going to consist of. But I just uploaded a video today. Well, it's going to upload later today. I'm supposed to be very intense. So yeah, my video is going to upload later today at I believe 5 o'clock. So if you haven't watched that video, go watch that video after you watch this video. Um, Yeah, so... Now I'm like, dang, okay, I didn't have anything else recorded. Like, I feel like I've taken such a long hiatus, which we're going to kind of touch on that a little bit at some point today. So, yeah, I'm just putting these earrings in. I don't really have too much to say right now. It does not feel like it's 10. I really want to leave. Let me see. My client is at 11.45. I'm trying to leave early enough to where I can get a matcha. So, like, if I can leave out, hold on. Yo, I've really been creating some curly girl content. Let me grab my clothes. I've really been creating like a bunch of hair content, y'all. Like, please do not play with me. I'm gonna get dressed though and then come back and talk to y'all. Okay, y'all. Now my scents is I'm gonna use these. My man bought me these back, y'all, from Dubai. So I can't tell you the name. <laughs> Okay. That was the wrong place. Where do you get this from? Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, y'all. So the scent of the day, I'm gonna use this body oil. I'm gonna use this one right here in the middle. I really can't tell y'all where this um come from or like even what's the name of it. It just says Platinum Bella Rosa, but it's an Arabic um body oil. My boyfriend brought me this from Saudi Arabia. So it's like take the top off open this and then i guess you like just rub this part on you i've used it like this would be my third time using it and it smells cool like it smells pretty strong i feel like it smells for a good part of the day like i didn't really smell it on me uh last night when i got home and i put it on it like close to 9 a.m and i didn't really smell it yesterday evening around like 6 p.m but i mean for the time being it did a job it smelled good so i just put a little bit of that on I need to take them out of this uh, box. I'm gonna do it later. And I'm going to wear Kayali Young Pistachio Gelato. What time is it? 11.04, can't need to hurry up. I need to put a necklace on. So yeah, 
that's what we smelling like today and i also i have a package from fashion nova y'all i gotta show it to y'all later but i'm gonna um open it right now but i'm gonna like go through everything with y'all later on when i get off work but i'm also gonna put on my rings which one do i put in this finger no 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 i'm lying i'll be putting this one on this finger this one and then this last one i need to put some cuticle oil and do my cuticles all right y'all so let me grab my sweater i'm gonna grab my sweater and then we are going to ah, head out okay so we're on the road now obviously i'm perfect timing i have time to stop and give me a matcha and then i'm gonna head on to the shop and we're gonna get started so today i was supposed to have four clients but this morning just did not go as planned so my first client i ended up having to move her appointment which i still haven't given her a new date and time yet i was trying to put her to this evening but it's not gonna work out for her so um i'm gonna end up having a break between my second and third client which is really gonna be my first and second client now because i mean my wait my second and fourth client is what I meant to say, which is really gonna be my first and second client. Cause like I was gonna say, I was supposed to have a client this morning, then I was gonna have another client for 11.45, which is the one I'm on the way to do now. And then I had another client for 1.45 and then another client for three o'clock. So how I was really gonna go now, my 1.45, she rescheduled because she has something to do that interferes with her last appointment. So she's not gonna be able to make it. So I'm going to do my 11.45 and then my three o'clock. So my 11.45, I'm gonna be done with her at like, 1 30 i think something like that so i'm gonna have a break from 1 30 to 3 o'clock but that's just an hour and 30 minutes like that's cool i'm not tripping i'll just edit my hair video that i recorded today and upload that and i'll also um build this thing that i have at the shop this little organizer drawer thingy y'all gonna see it i'm gonna show it to y'all similar to the ones that i have my makeup in at the shop but um I'm gonna build another one of those which is gonna be for my lashes and if I have time I'm gonna go run to Marshall's because I want to look and see if there's like a couple of Christmas items that I could get that I can maybe put up in the shop or put at my apartment or you know for both or whatever just see what they have so yeah uh, I'm gonna try to not waste too much time it shouldn't take me long at all to edit my reels my video like I that really quick i know i can knock that out quick oh and i need to find time up in there to also get something to eat because i didn't bring anything to eat today i may go get a subway sandwich i had that yesterday if i'm not mistaken or the day before yesterday if not yesterday my hair is pretty much like i thought it was 98 percent dry no it's not it was more like 90 percent dry it's still kind of damp like at the top right here the top of the back but i ain't trying it still look cool long as i don't you know touch it too much it'll be fine it'll dry cute so yeah, let's get this matcha. I'll talk to y'all once we almost to the salon. So I made it to my salon, y'all. So I just set up. Um, I turned on my lights, and I cut a couple of pieces of tape. And now we just wait on my first client to get here. While I wait on her, I'm gonna refill my um, oil diffuser with some water because it's empty. So I need to get that going. I have a pocket in the sweater. 
Yeah, I need to wipe this off. Why? Today has been just such a content filled day. Like, no way I'm getting three pieces of content at once. Really, four. Because um, the video that I just recorded, I can use for two different things. Well, really? I'm getting a lot of stuff. I'm gonna go with some water. I can't wait to hear Mariah's new album whenever she drops some new music. Since oh, the yeah, album. I know, for real. A lot of mm, concerts, you know, these days have got really do. expensive. But I just want to go to a lot of concerts, and I feel like it's because like, maybe I don't listen to them like so, so much, I don't really care. Mm -hmm. But like, I went to a 2 concerts by myself. Oh, yeah, yeah. Even though you don't know none of people that's around you, you know, mm -hmm. you all got something. More it, yeah, right. They don't like this artist. See, a lot of a lot of girls listen to Drake. Bro, he not talking about like no guns and shit like that. So I was I'm gonna go to Drake concert. I know when I have a family, I'm gonna be just like Taylor. Yeah, I'm gonna be crying down for everything. <laughs> See that? Like she was like jealous. Like girl, she yes. Was, like, she loved her she daddy. Like <laughs> and the lift, and he spoke Spanish. She didn't speak no. He didn't really understand no English. Mhm. Mm and I was trying to say something to him. I think I was trying to ask him, to, can you please turn the air on? Mm -hmm. Girl, I know how to say that. <laughs> and, and general it's, statements. It's general and also it's proper. Mm, yes. Like, so they're doing Duolingo. Like, some of us was telling her, she's like, girl, what? We don't say that. Like, that's not how we say it. She's like, wait, I'll really be fluent in it. Because, I don't know. It's just hard not to. At least, you know, if I never become fluent, at least I'll be able to speak well enough to save my life. <laughs> the time is 11.23 a.m. No, it's not. It is 1.23. It is 9.11.23. All right, y'all. So, I have an hour and 30 minutes left. Did I get off, like, at the right time? Well, I was supposed to finish her at 1.15. Yeah, I finished her about that time. So, yeah. I need to go get something to eat. I guess I'm going to go do that first. I think I'm going to go get something to eat. That way, I can come back here and have time to build my uh thing so this is what i'm gonna build i'm about to build this so i can put my last trees in because right now i just have them all stacked up on side of this thing i don't know what i want to get like i don't know if i should get subway but i think i had subway i told y'all that i think i had subway yesterday or the day before yesterday so i don't really want subway but i don't know what else to get like i could go to ross's and get something from there but what am i gonna get the little finger sandwiches i always do that why is my camera not focusing i always get those i always get those little finger sandwiches and they only keep me full why is it doing that it only keep me full it, don't, it honestly don't ever get me full but it keeps me satisfied for not that long um, my hair is pretty much dry now and it's still really flat, which I'm happy about because I mean this style is gonna last a while. I'm probably gonna have to redo this later. I clearly didn't put enough product at the end of my hair, so it's just eh, looking like that instead of being all defined like this side, which I could have did a little bit on that side also. But I need to go put some. I'm definitely gonna put some product at the end of this later. But um, yeah, so I'm not gonna have time to do Marshalls and all of that. Like I could, but then I'm gonna be rushing to put together that thing. And I really don't wanna stay no later, later. So I should just hurry up and go get something to eat. But what are we eating? I don't know, I don't know. I really don't know. A few moments later. Hey y'all, I'm back at the shop now. And I ended up getting Subway for lunch really quick. I just got a meatball sandwich. I just get some meatballs with American cheese. And I get it lightly toasted. Be so good with uh, Italian herbs and cheese. Mm-hmm. So good. And I'm on the phone with Michaela. Say hey MK. Hey y'all. So yeah, y'all, that's what we're doing. And it's 149. My client, I told y'all already, is at 3 o'clock. So I got like an hour and 11 minutes to eat my food. I'm gonna edit my hair video and then I'm gonna put together the little rolling cart thingy that I told y'all about. And so I'll check in with y'all once I'm done editing my video. Okay, y'all, so I finished my video my phone is on the charger though so i can't even show it to y'all right now but i finished my video and now we're gonna get ready to build the um 
organizer and i don't really want to set up the camera and show y'all me building the whole organizer because that's just gonna take a little minute and i'm just trying to hurry up and knock this out so i'll check back in with y'all ever so often or maybe when i'm done i don't know this is the little six drawer thing that i built it came out kind of cute it's just super super small but tomorrow i'm gonna add my lash trays in there so that i can see you know how effective it is and if i don't like it push come to shove i'll just sell it on facebook marketplace so we are now clocking out hey y'all i've been home for a little time now it's currently uh 807 all i've done was like went to the grocery store to get um food for dinner oh, i need to go fix this tonight i forgot but all i've done is going to the grocery store got stuff for dinner and then um chilled on the couch for a little bit responded to some text messages and picked up my amazon package so i got some more um my things my little caddies in the shower broke from amazon because they're just cheap so they broke and uh, now I need to change them out. Oh, I don't I need to. So yeah, it got like three. Wait, let me show y'all. So like, see, oopsies, focus. So you see like, this is it. And you see like all of them, they all broke off. It's supposed to look like this. Wait, I can't step in there, y'all. But it's supposed to look like that one. And that one. The middle one broke off too. And when that middle one broke off, that's when I was like, all right. Gotta order another one. So I got another one. It's in a um it's in the kitchen. But I'm gonna try to like blow dry this. So I remember seeing somewhere that they said to put blow dryer on the adhesive to get it off. And I hope that this works. Let's see. if this is working or not so i'm finna show y'all what i got from fashion nova now i have these two bags on here on the floor i'm gonna try a couple of things on not all of the things but what i can try on i'm gonna try on and then whatever else y'all just got to see whenever i wear it so let's get into the fashion nova haul well now i'm gonna show y'all everything i got from fashion nova obviously i'm gonna start off with this sweater because y'all already saw i opened the sweater this morning and i really like this sweater it's super cute I got this black sweater. This one is similar to the new one that I wore today, but just in black. I'm not trying this on, but this is just a plain white button down shirt because I just felt like I needed one of these. I got this long coat, black. I'm trying to get my um, winter slash fall wardrobe together. Where do I be going? Nowhere. But I'm gonna be looking cute for my maintenance appointments. I'm gonna be elevating the looks, you know, with a trench. I can put a trench coat. Y'all see where it's up? I got a similar one in this cute neutral color. Oh, let's see. Yeah, I got this one. I gotta put a full body mirror right in here, but this is cute. And it got little pockets. This one stops a slight bit longer than the black. I was hesitant to order this because usually when I order clothes from Fashion Nova, um, stuff like this, it'd be really, really big on me. And I can tell this is gonna be big on me as well because like I can just look at the pants and tell that it's gonna be kind of big in a week. But I got this cream set. I'm not gonna try it on, but yeah, it's cute. Or just like church or something. So if you watch my other fashion overhaul vlog, you would have seen that I got these gray sweatpants and I love those gray sweatpants. Like I have literally worn them out so many times already. So I got the same sweat in black. I love these sweatpants. Okay, I was excited about this piece right here. I'm excited about this. What is long and is this really nice olive green? But It's giving uh, grown and sophisticated, okay? How would you like this coat? So yeah, got this coat. And it's heavy. I was kind of excited about this too. This is a cute little set that I had on my wish list for a minute. But it's a cute little brown sweater with the pants. Like, that's cute. 
This is the last sweater. Um, this is extremely thin. I don't know how I that this was much thicker than what it is, but I cannot wear this until like it's just a little cool outside. It is way too cool. But it's but it's cute though. Cute little thin cardigan. Nah, it kind of does look how it looked on the website. I don't know. But yeah, this is cool. I wear this if it's like not too cool outside. That was it for all of the cool the items. Let me pick all these bags up and then I'm gonna show you all these little accessories that I got. I got three pairs of shades. I think these are cute. I like it. I cannot wait till Mardi Gras. I did not really participate in Mardi Gras this year, but next year I am definitely participating. I'm, I'm gonna tell my friends right now actually, because we need to get a hotel. I'm not. Well, they already live that way, but we are not. I'm not driving back home. I just want to get something like a little different for me. And I think that this is cute. I think this is real cute. I like this. I like these two. All of them are really similar. This will probably be like my least favorite out of all three, but I still like it. So I'm not going to really say anything bad about it, but yes okay so on to some things that i recently got from sephora so when sephora had their savings the sephora savings sale i went in and i got the it was three of the fenty lip oils uh, i think it was like 30 dollars for three different flavors i guess you'll call it three different yeah flavors so i've been loving those like and what i love about it the most is that it don't leave that white line in my lip mat because i hate that that's so disgusting with my points I got the Dr. Dennis Gross Extra Strength Daily Peel. I never used these before, but I seen a girl use this like in an intimate area and intimate areas. And she said it really worked. So I don't know. I might try it. I don't know. Really not that hard up because it's really like not that hard. I got the Sephora Micro Smooth Powder because I've been wanting to try this powder and plus it's like only $20. So I'm going to use it for the first time on Sunday whenever I do my makeup. Or I may do my makeup on Saturday, but I think I'm going to wait and do my makeup Sunday for church. So I got that and then I also got this, what is this again? Um, A cream and powder blush. She's the Moment by Patrick Ta. Oh, I forgot it was this way. So it's just this really pretty peachy color. I'm gonna record a video for my Instagram because this is a nice color. This is another one of the lip oil flavors. This one is one I've been using which is uh, cherry and then is it called cherry? It's called Barbados cherry. This one is Kalari melon and then the other one that I have is in my gym bag. So. Yeah those are my latest pickups. And I think we're gonna call it a night y'all and i'll just catch up with y'all in the morning so see y'all tomorrow so. Hey besties, good morning. It is the, I don't even know what today is. It's Saturday though. It's Saturday, November 23rd. I did not vlog yesterday. Yesterday all I did was I just went to work and came home, made some dinner. Uh, did I do homework? I don't know. But it wasn't really much. It wasn't nothing for me to vlog for real. But today it is Saturday your girl feels like she is flourishing because it is cold outside even though I, I still be cold like you would swear i'm anemic because i be cold and people be like it's really not that cold outside 
but I be kind of cool. So I got my Uggs on. Y'all already know once you start to feel a little breeze, especially when you're from down south, baby, you start to feel a little breeze, you should pull out the Uggs immediately. Immediately. So I got the Uggs on, baby. Got my little sweater on from Fashion Nova. It just, it feel good outside. My hair look good. I'm feeling good. And it's just gonna be a great day. I'm gonna do three clients. My first client is a full set with a brow wax. My second, I think she can a hybrid full set. Hybrid full set with a brow wax. Then my second client is a brow wax and tint. And then my third client is my sister and she's just getting a full classic set and my camera is going dead. And I think I got out the battery, battery with me. I hope I do. But yeah, my third client, final client is my sister. She's just getting a classic full set and we will wrap it up for the day. I need to go to the store because I need to try to get something for my nephew for his first birthday tomorrow. I really don't know what you buy a baby, like especially a one year old because they really not doing too much at one. So I really don't know what to get him, but I'm gonna go to Target and see what they have in the baby section. See if they have anything like any Elmo toys, but it's like Ace got everything. So I don't even know what to get him. Like my sister and them have him so spoiled. So I don't even know what to get him that he possibly don't have already. So we are gonna see, especially at Target because she loves Target. So we are gonna see, we are gonna see, we are gonna see. Hey Bessie, so I'm back. I'm off work now, obviously. I went to Ulta. And I told y'all, you know, got my vanity set up, so I'm obviously gonna start doing my makeup. And I need to build my own personal makeup kit. So I organized my makeup. I'm gonna show y'all, but let me show y'all these brushes first. But I organized my makeup um, in here when I first built the desk. But I need some brushes and I don't want to be using my brushes that I use on like my clients. I want to use my, I want my own personal stash just like I've built my own personal stash of makeup. So I got this Real Techniques set. This is the Everyday Essential set. It has a big fluffy brush, a beauty blender, this little dense brush, this setting brush, and then this pretty dense brush that I can use for like um, cream contour. I got, I got these from Real Techniques. This is the Glow Round Base Brush. Um, I usually don't buy, I typically wouldn't buy a brush that's shaped like this, but I, they didn't have the Insta Pop Cheek Brush, which is really my favorite brush for um, blending foundation. So I just like, you know what, I'll try this. This cool, it's a dense round shade with flat top for airbrush buffing. I think that that could work for my foundation. I don't know. Um, and the other one that I showed is the eye shade and blend set. So it's just three eye brushes. I got a setting brush, even though it's one in that other set, the uh, Everyday Essential set. I said you also get another one because sometimes I be putting too much concealer and I be needing like a second one. I use that brush. Religiously, I have a lot of those in my makeup kit at the shop. I got the blush and highlight brush duo, which I've showed y'all this in my last video. Got this great brushes for a very cheap price, and then I also got this Eco Tools set, which is the angled liner eye brush, a dense crease eye brush, full blush face brush, blurring concealer brush, angled foundation brush, foundation face brush. And then I also picked up MAC Cork Lip Liner. And now, let me show y'all, um, I need to open these brushes, but I don't have anywhere to put them in right now. But let me show y'all what I did. So I need to move my hair still. So let me show y'all what I did. I put this here. Um, This is just... This is what I got from Sephora. I showed y'all this last night. I mean, not last night. Whenever that was. I don't know. The other night. Yeah. My powders are in here. And that's a blush, obviously. And then my lippy in here. I have my highlighters, um, bronzers, face powders, blush. Just all powders. And then this is in this container. I don't know if I had it on here. I think I did. But... 
this one is my lip liners and this is an eyeliner but it's just liners and then my setting sprays are right here and lashes in the middle i have my foundations concealers primers and brow gel um powder bronzer and blush uh, i mean mascaras liquid blush and then over here i just have my palettes which i'm gonna get rid of these palettes i'm gonna take some of my palettes from the shop and bring here because i don't use all of those palettes and some of them like have similar shades in it so now that i'm gonna be doing my makeup from home now that i'm gonna be doing my makeup from home more often now i might as well take some of them here so yeah i need to leave out and go to target later so when i leave out go to target that's when i'm gonna look for something to put these brushes in i may go to like home goods or something on me i may even go to like tj maxx i don't know wherever i feel like going but yeah i need to go put my camera batteries on the charger i don't even know where i put the other battery at i think it's in my room but i need to put these batteries in the charger because the one that i have in the camera now is all i have enough i can put up this lip liner right now i'm excited i cannot wait to use this i'm gonna do my makeup in the morning and i'm gonna show you i also have other lip liners that i didn't use i still haven't used these lip liners by morphe Yes, I still haven't used these Morphe lip liners. I didn't even watch this. I don't know why I didn't watch them. Like, why am I just watching them? Really? Oh, I can't wait to see how you show them. I think tomorrow I'm going to use the night. Okay, so the very bottom shade. Okay, I'm reading the name, buddy. Okay, shoot, I forgot her name. Okay, so this bottom shade is cork. Okay, so this very bottom shade is cork by Mac. This middle shade is Morphe Honey, and then this top shade is Morphe uh, Other Half. I'm gonna use the MAC one tomorrow when I do my makeup, and I'm gonna do a really natural look, of course, like always. I'm kinda tired of this hairstyle because I'm tired of the curls like falling into my face. I, when I did this style, I really wanted it all to like go back, but why did I expect my hair to go back? Like, I should've known it was gonna fall to the side, especially by like how I did the braids. Like, I went off to the side. But it's still cute. I'm gonna fluff it out a lot tomorrow because Monday I think I'm gonna like maybe redo my hair, do something different. I don't know. I may just keep the braids in the front. Nothing's wrong with it. The curls are really still curling. Like, let me know if y'all want me to do like some natural hair videos. Like, I've been doing them on Instagram. I've been pretty consistent the last couple of weeks. I've been posting a lot of videos. But I can do some longer forms on my channel for y'all like what y'all see that and then this side so much definition oh this is all stuck together okay y'all do not be like me i am super procrastinating because i have a lot of food with guys to get done tonight i have literally a five page reflection that's due tonight and i'm sitting up here just yapping and yapping and yapping with y'all for the absolute longest i need to go get to this homework if you're literally watching if you're watching my video right now and you're procrastinating you need to be doing something else girl do not be paying attention to this video leave this as background noise and get to doing what you gotta do don't be like me be better so i'll see y'all in the next clip Hey y'all, so I'm back and I went to Home Goods and I got this to put the brushes in. It was Oh my ex 
Hey besties, good morning. It is Sunday the, I don't even know what the date is. Today is, it's the 24th and it's 9.05 a.m. I've been up since 7 a.m. but I got a lot of things done and now it's time to get ready for church. I'm going to the 11.30 service today so got some time. I would like to be ready and out here by like 10 40 something because i think i want to stop and get a coffee from seven brew i want to get a blondie so i think i'm gonna leave out a little early and then the parking be atrocious there so that's why i'm trying to get there a little early even though it's only like 15 minutes away from where i live i'm gonna try to get there pretty early let's get into this makeup i already did my skincare let's just get right into it i'm gonna watch my girl taja's vlog and uh, we're about to knock this makeup out. I'm going to do something really natural. Let me see. I'm going to do something real natural though. Of course, always natural. I said I need to take some of those palettes from the shop. And I forgot to do that yesterday. Yeah. I don't know if I said that when I got home or if I said that before then. I don't know. But I'm going to go in probably with this chocolates palette by Juvia's Place. So yeah i'll show y'all the products as i'm using them but just follow along you know let's see how long it takes it's 907. if i wrote you a symphony just to say how much you mean to me what would you do if i told you you were beautiful would you date me on the regular? Tell me, would you? Well, baby, I've been around the world But I ain't seen myself another girl Like you This ring here represents my heart But there's just one thing I need from you Say I do because I can see us holding hands, walking on the beach, our toes in the sand. I can see us on the countryside, sitting on the grassland side by side. You could be my baby, let me make you my baby. Girl, you amaze me, ain't gotta do nothing crazy. See, all I want you to do is be my love. So don't give away my love. love. So don't give away my love. love. So don't give away. And another woman that can take your spot, my love. So don't give away my love. love. So don't give away my love. love. Is another woman that can take your spot, my love
Okay, y'all, I'm back because I was trying to show y'all the lip products and it wasn't really showing up on camera. But I'm going in with Charlotte Tilbury lipstick and Cover Star, and I'm going in with the Anastasia lip gloss in Guava. <laughs> Y'all, I'm really upset because I thought I was filming. I thought I was recording. I recorded a whole clip. Well, at least I thought I recorded a whole clip. But this is the Cover Star Lipstick by Charlotte Tilbury by itself. And I'm going over it with the Anastasia Gloss and Guava. And ignore this pencil. My cycle is about to start. But I freaking love it. And I'm definitely going back and buy more of her lipsticks. Like, this is so freaking cute. I don't know why I stopped wearing lipstick and only started wearing gloss. Like, I even used to wear lipstick and gloss together, like how I'm about to do today. And I just stopped all of that. But I'm really finna get back into my makeup bag. Like, but yeah, let's do this lip so we can move on to the hair. Let's get into it. Time to do my hair. And I really am not sure what I'm about to do, but I do know that I need to go get my pick because I think I want big hair. So I think I'm gonna pull these curls apart, pick this out. I'm gonna just wear those. So I'm gonna go in with my TGIN curl oh, fresher. <laughs> And after I finish this, I only get to get dressed and put on my face. Doing the glam room has made my life. I'm 
no more I keep on running back to you Baby, I don't know why you wanna do me wrong See, when I'm home, I'm all alone And you are always gone Boy, you know I really love you I can't deny I can't see how you could bring me to so many tears After all these years See, my days are cold without you my Okay, y'all, now that I got my hair together, I'm gonna go on and do the fit. I really don't know what I'm gonna wear, but I'm gonna figure it out. Given where this little two piece set from Fashion Nova, and nothing's wrong with that. Let me see what the temperature is looking like outside, because I'm sure it's probably pretty cool. Oh, it's 67. Oh, it's gonna warm up. Hold up. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I gotta go back. Okay, never mind, y'all. I think I'm still gonna wear this fit because it's cool and it's really not that hot outside. So, I mean, I may bring another shirt. I may bring a shirt to change into after church, but for now, this is just gonna be the fit. Watch out, look at here. So for now, this is just gonna be the fit. Oh well. It's this little two piece set. If you saw my Fashion Nova haul, you saw it. I think I'm gonna pair it with my pair with this purse. I wish, I mean, this I could do as a crossbody, but I don't wanna wear a crossbody. I think I'm gonna wear it on my shoulder. I'm gonna do, I really don't want y'all in my shower. The heck? Yeah, look at me. My shower is still in it, but it ain't the focus no more. I need another silver necklace. I, I want to go to Pandora, but I think I'm going to just order it. But they have a sale, and I want to go in person because I want to make sure I'm getting the correct length. I don't know what length my necklaces be. I just be buying the necklaces. Like. So, can this go a little tighter? Okay, I think this is the tightest it goes. Okay, yeah, that's cool. I'll put on my story. I don't know what shoes I wanna wear. I I don't know. Let me see. My boyfriend said it's cute, but it doesn't give church. Uh, my friends say, well, one of my friends said that it's cute, but it gives two different vibes. So I think the shoes is the problem. So I'm gonna change my shoes. I don't know what shoes I'm gonna put on, but. I'm gonna change these. Okay, y'all. I changed. I'm gonna show y'all the shoes that I changed into, but right now I'm gonna get some smell goods going. I'm gonna put on my Gilded Vanilla by Victoria's Secret. This has quickly, since I first bought it last weekend, became a favorite. I love it. I love it. I love it. And I don't know why I just randomly thought about this, but I am so sad that like today is my only off day. Because usually I'm off on Sundays and Mondays, but I am not off tomorrow, which I'm still going to take y'all along with me tomorrow and probably end the vlog tomorrow night or something like that. But I'm not off tomorrow. I'm taking two lash clients and I'm going to do a makeup one-on-one, -on -one, very beginner friendly. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. Put my charger stick on. I really need to put it this way. I can't have it the wrong way. Next, where's my oil? Oh, okay. I'm gonna go in with this hemp oil. It's a common relief body oil. Um, I'm really not really using it. I mean, I'm really not using it for like the smell. Just using it because it's really hydrating and that lotion that I put on is not. And I also want my perfume to like stick a little longer. Cause I kind of got a long day ahead, not too long, but at the church, I need to go back home to my family because it is my nephew Ace's birthday. So, I'm going to celebrate with my boy. Do I want to wear this oil today? I don't think so. I will. So yeah, I'm gonna wear the oil. Oops. I'm gonna wear the oil that my boyfriend got me. I showed y'all this oil already. Same scent, because it's my favorite scent out of the three. Mm. 
That oil in the chest really just does it. Like, seriously, look at me. It's 10.55. Like, I went, I'm talking about I want to get there so early, blah, blah, blah. Girl, please. I was going to put some cuticle oil on, but my cuticles really don't look that bad. I'm still put a little bit, though. I really like this perfume and I don't wear it that often so I'm going to wear the Billie Eilish perfume. This is the vanilla one. I thought it was pretty empty. I was going to say. Yeah, this is the Eilish. So this is the... Y'all see it. It's gold. Looking good. Smelling good. Let's go touch up the lips. Yeah, I need to touch up my lips. I need to switch over my stuff. And do that while I'm passing here. So I need to put like my wallet and stuff into this first. I'm also gonna bring my sun shades that I have in here. One of my pair of shades that I just got from Fashion Nova. Oh, I need to bring my work phone because my December schedule is about to open at 12. I'm gonna be at church at that time. So I hope if anyone is gonna text, they don't text at 12. No one texts me since yesterday, thankfully. I need to upgrade that phone, y'all. I'm gonna upgrade my work phone because I spend enough money on that phone a month to wear. Oh, why am I taking this person? Now? I spend enough money on that phone a month to the point where I need to be using it for more than just responding to my clients. Like, I pay a whole phone bill. Like, I pay for the phone. Like, I need to be doing more than just texting my clients on there. So, I'm going to get a new one. I'm going to upgrade that phone. Um, I really don't know when. I really don't know when, but sometime soon, I'm going to upgrade that phone to the iPhone 16. And I'm going to use it as my content phone too. Like my phone right now, I have one terabyte of um, storage. But I, I got so much content recorded up in there. Content that y'all have never even seen. And it's taking up all my storage. And before the end of the year, I am going to clean out my phone and just like delete apps that I don't use. Delete messages, delete contacts, delete photos, all of that gonna do a complete reset of my phone because no way i have seven thousand and something items in my camera roll that is just too much a lot of that stuff is nonsense a lot of it is like pictures that look exactly the same screenshots just like silly screenshots like it's just it needs to get cleaned out because i really don't need a new phone so i'm gonna get one terabyte of storage for my work phone i need to order it the lip combo eats I need to film the ending of my video. I be hating how the quality looks on my phone, like on front camera. I be hating it. I need to start using my back camera. Okay, let's see. Cute. Okay, it's cute. I'm not gonna complain. It's cute. Ah, I think we're eating. I need to leave. Okay, this last one. Eating the girls up. Okay, so I told y'all how I wanted to get a coffee. Baby, please. I drove literally straight past Seven Brew because that was just so disappointing. It was so many cars, y'all. Like, so many cars. I ain't never seen it wrapped around a building that far. That's just how many people were there trying to get a drink. And it's always like that on a Sunday morning. I don't know why I expected anything different because the couple of times when I wanted to get a coffee on my way to church, I've never been able to because the line is just always wrapped around. I would have to leave out super early to get one. So I could have waited. Like they go pretty fast, but I didn't want to sit and take that long. Like I'm going to church with my mom this morning and she already there. So I don't want to have her like waiting on me for too long. Because I'm being selfish getting a coffee. It's fine. I do not need a coffee. I may get one. If I still want one, I'll get one around 12.30 when church is over. And I leave. I probably won't even want one by then. I probably will want a matcha. So I probably will still end up going to 7 Brew. I'll just go to the one in Gonzales. So that may work. Because I'm honest, I'm not in a rush to get home. 
well to get like to uh to the place i'm not in a rush so i might stop and get a matcha but yeah y'all the face is eating don't be like me be better do not be vlogging and driving the face is eating sound like like what who is she service was so good today the preacher was talking about basically how he was preaching out of john um john chapter five and he was basically talking about how we have a tendency of becoming stagnant he was using the um an analogy talking about the front porch and how you use your front porch for like comfortability it becomes like a safe haven how we get so comfortable in what's comfortable that we don't grow and he was just saying how god you know he reminds us through faith and grace like we're saved by faith through grace and that's my favorite thing about jesus i feel like is that he is just so gracious like he literally will meet you where you're at he will literally come down to where you are and meet you where you're at and take you with him take you under him god's grace is just it's amazing and that's why i be feeling so bad for people that just don't believe in religion because it's like huh i don't know another topic for, that's not for my channel but that's my favorite that's one of my favorite things about jesus like he really will meet you exactly where you're at you could be all the way down here in the dirt he will come to where you at and get you from where you at he was talking about how the man was literally waiting for jesus he was waiting for 38 years to be healed and he was thinking that he had to go to this healing pool he's like if i i think he was blind uh, correct me if i'm wrong y'all but if i can remember correct he was blind the man was blind and i believe that this was a story out of the bible but i ain't there yet so he was saying how the man was blind i believe um he was waiting for jesus well he was waiting for healing for 38 years he was sitting aside thinking that he needed to make it to this healing pool whole time the healing pool brought itself to him which was jesus jesus came to him and said do you want to be made well it's that easy and then jesus is gonna tell you pick up your mess put it on your back and follow me that's all you gotta do pick up your mess and take it with you as you follow jesus and watch how he gonna work through it he gonna work through it he gonna clear it up clear it out and put some new stuff for you ain't that the good news okay y'all i literally just got in the car i ain't wasting no time pulling out my camera and vlogging for y'all because i it is now 2 38 and i should have been i should be like arriving <sighs> this freaking guy came out here y'all and he just kept freaking looking at me when i was coming out the uh full place oh i knew i messed up my makeup i hope you're not looking for me because i'm definitely gonna hurry up and pull out he look like he is ready to go down y'all okay so like i was saying just leaving um the food place and we went to this place in gonzalez called vicious biscuit it was so freaking good i got a hot chicken sandwich so good y'all oh my gosh that was so good i didn't even care about potentially messing up my makeup to eat that sandwich because oh it was rolling that was good yeah, go right back inside, boy. I was like, baby, I do not care if I get anything on my face, any uh food on my face or anything, because that was rolling. I needed to enjoy that meal. It was so good. It was so good. That was so good but the waitress was rude so yeah y'all now i'm gonna head off i think i told y'all it's my shirt i think i told y'all that it's my nephew ace birthday today so i'm headed off to their house and i will just see y'all once we get there 
give, give Medusa way and rockin' you I don't wanna start preaching. Baby, leave me alone I gotta fight Maybe cause we gotta fight Hey y'all, so I'm finally almost to my sister's house um, and I was just thinking y'all I was posting some pictures on my story that I took this morning before church and I was just looking and I just, Oh my gosh, I didn't know people's stories and stuff like But it's just so crazy how it's like sometimes when you just live it every day You don't really realize changes. That's just like when they say like when people gain your weight They'll be like, you know, you're getting bigger and bigger or you're getting smaller and smaller And you see yourself every day So it's like it don't be that much of a drastic difference in your eyes day to day until you see a picture of yourself from like maybe some months ago or years ago and then you see a picture of you recently and then it's like dang it really hit you like dang i really put on some weight or i really lost some weight but i'm looking at the pictures that like i posted i mean the pictures that i took this morning and i'm just thinking back and looking at old pictures from like two years ago i'm gonna say two years ago because uh, i'm gonna say i guess you can even say one year ago but i'm just I, i'm picturing old pictures of myself from not this year and it's just like it's just so crazy how much i changed like and i feel like you can tell in my videos as well like i don't even speak the same and like a little bit i do like don't don't think i'm trying to say like i'm a whole you know did a whole 180 you know but i feel like i'm getting close enough like i have changed so much i've learned so much and but that's what life is all about like i'm not trying to make a big deal out of it but it's just like that's what life is all about you're supposed to do that you're supposed to change and grow and evolve and just learn new things do new things become new people like we have free will you can literally do whatever you want like i'm not holding myself back no more and i'm not surrounding myself with stagnant small-minded freaking uh, optimistic people i mean pessimistic people i only want the best for myself period and everyone should want the best for themselves like all of you watching this video y'all should want the best for yourselves as well do not be out here tolerating and have this and have that and i really feel like this journey really 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 like progressed for me once i got into a relationship because it's like and i'm not saying like you gotta be into a relationship to really grow in life but i'm just saying like i noticed personally once i got with my boyfriend like i don't know like I just always be saying like I just feel like I strongly feel like my boyfriend is my husband like I feel like that is my person and we are going to be together and I've always felt strong like this since the first day I met him and I feel like it's, it's, it's mutual because we just went full throttle with each other from the jump but anyways anyways anyway that's besides the point and if somebody trying to go full throttle with you from the jump don't don't be listening and following behind me do not be following behind me only do what feels right to you what genuinely feels right and natural like not forced at all like let it be organic if it has to be organic but anyways i just feel like once we got together i immediately was like dang like i'm in a relationship now i need to focus on other things like i ain't gonna okay basically in a nutshell what i should have said from the jump instead of rambling on and on and on is the fact that i was spending too much time before i was in a relationship focusing on wanting a relationship or just focusing on relationships. I'm not even gonna say focusing on wanting a relationship. It's just that the fact, cause I can't say I was focusing on wanting a relationship because the guys that I was dealing with was definitely, I'm not, I wasn't gonna be in a relationship with them. But I was just, I don't know y'all. Once I got my boyfriend, I'm like, yeah, this is it. Time for me to focus on the things that I'm supposed to be focusing on anyways, which is really my personal growth, my business growth, career growth, like just everything growing all around as an individual and in life like i'm growing in other relationships as well but you know that's still a part of me growing as an individual i'm learning how to handle people relationships you know different personalities and stuff like that differently i'm learning new approaches to take so yeah i just feel like i'm so proud seeing all of the growth that has occurred within me within like the last year or something and i know that it's not because of the relationship it's because of what the relationship pushed me to do so i feel like yeah i was already you know growing my relationship with god but i'm not gonna lie like i was doing better than what i'm doing now like of course i'm getting better and better each week month day i was second <laughs> that was dramatic but <laughs> y'all get what i'm saying y'all get what i'm saying i feel like i'm already progressing but at a much faster pace than what i was progressing 
prior to my relationship and that is partially because my boyfriend he's so strong up in his faith that it's like he really motivates me pushes me to just be the best me all around and i feel like i've been getting everything locked down except the gym i am not that consistent in the gym like i was doing so good over the summer but it's like i really need to pick back up and i'm really gonna start right getting up in the morning like i'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get up tomorrow morning go to the gym if not tomorrow morning i'll go after my uh second client so that way i could just go home take a shower and then go back into my last client i have enough time to do that i believe you. so yeah i just need to get it together in the gym but it's like i'm just so proud to see my growth and i just know that once i got in my bible more to grow my relationship with god like at a at a real scale i'm gonna say because i feel like people post bro is this truck like what, is, what are they doing they keep throwing brakes why are you riding their tail and then you got me thinking that you going all fast and they're going fast or something like that and i shouldn't get over but okay so yeah i don't be liking when people be posting like all of those bible scriptures blah 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 and they never like they probably don't even own a bible and that's not me like judging because i know people be saying christians be super judgy but it's like y'all we really gotta do better like nothing wrong with posting the scriptures and stuff like that like yes spread the word spread the bible i mean spread the gospel spread the spread all of it but we have to do a better job at taking accountability and getting into our words y'all like we really gotta do better we gotta do better because i used to be guilty of the same thing and i never felt like i never felt no type of way but i don't want to say i never felt convicted about it because i don't feel like that's something that god will convict you about posting scriptures but not really living it i mean i don't know i don't know i, don't, I ain't that deep yet but yeah i just feel like we need to do better we need to do better even if it's like getting up in the morning you know just doing like little five minutes a day by reading a daily uh word the daily verse like you know maybe start in start with the gospel start with john and then go to matthew mark and luke and then just play it in the morning like while you're doing something like if you work out put some put your headphones on and just click play go to matthew chapter one verse one and click play and just listen i mean you're not really studying and stuff like that but i mean at least you're still trying to you're still consuming god's word and i have definitely noticed a big difference in my days when I start off my days, like whether I'm reading my Bible, whether I just did my devotional only, whether I listen to the Bible for a little bit, whether I listen to a Christian a podcast, it, I just always, I feel like I go about my days much better. My days are much more smooth. I feel like I have a more clear level mind and head, a clear level head space. Um, I just feel much better. I feel like I respond much better uh, i communicate better with people like it's just healthier i feel like i'm slower to anger slower to speak i'm very proud of my growth i'm very 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 proud the lord has really also been bridling my tongue if you know, you know the mouth is vicious sometimes but he's just been really doing the work in me y'all and when i was just posting the pictures on my story and looking at it and then thinking about it looking at the old pictures i was just like dang Hey y'all, so I realized that I never came back and showed y'all the shoes that I changed into. But I changed into my Doc Martens. And y'all, it is so freaking crazy. The last time I wore these boots was for LSU Homecoming, I believe. No, I'm lying. It was LSU versus Grambling tailgate last year in 2023. That was the last time I wore these boots. Y'all, they had got so dusty at the tailgate. Like, they were full of dust. I'm surprised that I didn't have to clean my shoe laces. The laces were cool, but the rest of the shoe, I just took it. And it was so easy and so quick to clean. I don't know why I waited over a year to clean them. That's just lazy. Like, I even moved those shoes from the old apartment to this apartment. Still dirty. And still carrying the box around. But, yeah. Finally cleaned them this morning. All I took was my hair spray bottle. Sprayed a little water on them. And wiped them with a towel. That was it. It was literally so easy. But that's what I wore. Just got home. I am very tired. I have an exam to take tonight. But I have an Amazon package, y'all. One of the things that was supposed to come tomorrow ended up coming today. I don't know if I'm going to unbox it today. I don't know. It really just depends on what time I finish up with my priorities. So I'm going to take a shower right now because I'm tired. So I'm going to take a shower, 
wash my face and once i get out the shower i'm more than likely going to eat i stopped by my auntie and got some uh food i think she made my mama said cabbage but i could have sworn they said that they were making mustard greens so i think i got mustard greens cornbread rice and fried chicken i cannot wait to eat it let me see what time is it it's 7 36. put my jewelry up Drinking some water because I am so thirsty. I have not been drinking much water today. And my makeup still looks really good, y'all. I absolutely love it. Um, I don't have on no lipstick right now. I just have on lip liner. But it looks so freaking good. I've really been loving wearing my hair. Like, I said I was going to get a sewing for my birthday. But I don't know. I, I don't know. I just really just don't feel like doing my hair. But... My curls do last a lot of days, but then again, I don't want it to be all frizzy like this at the top. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do something to it. Might switch it up. Get a sew in. I don't know. Maybe for tomorrow, because I'm tired of wearing these braids just down like this. I could have did this today. I should just put the pony, the braids up into a ponytail. That's cute, huh? You like that? Comment down below. Let me know if y'all think this hairstyle is cute with the braids in the front and do like a ponytail on top. I think that would be cute. But yeah, y'all, let me go ahead and take a shower because my cousin Cole is finna come over. I'll talk to y'all after the shower. Hey besties, it's Monday now. It's 1.33 and I need to be leaving out soon because I gotta go do a client for 2.30. So I'm probably gonna leave home at like two o'clock ish something like that but y'all never saw me film from right here because obviously i've just been spending a whole lot of time in my second bedroom which is what i'm turning into like my little beauty room content room or whatever and we're making such great progress so happy so excited and i love being in here now when y'all see me film at the vanity you know you could kind of see in the background like this area where i'm sitting at and you see like the other area that i need to move over here you see that but you also see this this is cute i like that um y'all saw me setting that up in my last vlog uh but now today we're gonna get this wall together i was indecisive on whether i wanted to put like a tv on the wall or do i want to do like some decor on the wall but i'm not really that good at decorating so uh well really just like putting things together period unless it's like makeup stuff but anyways um yeah i saw this really cute idea on pinterest let me show y'all the pin i just absolutely love pinterest like it's social media but not social so i saw this girl do this and i thought that this was really really cute with the shelves on the wall and have stuff on the shelves so like i just started looking at other come on i hope y'all can see but yeah i started seeing other people doing like similar things and I think that that's really cute. I should have got a short shelf to throw somewhere up in there. But I'm just going to do three long shelves. So I bought three long white shelves. And I'm going to put along this wall right here. And so that can be in the background from like when I'm sitting right here. Because y'all going to see this angle more often. Um, But you, that can be my background when I'm sitting here. And it can also be part of my background when I'm sitting at the vanity. But I also have some smaller packages that I would just want to go ahead and open with y'all. I literally just picked them up. So this is the first package. This is the smallest one, so that's why I'm starting with this one. I hate when it be so wasteful, just the rest of the box is empty. What is this? Oh, this is going to the shop with me. Oh my gosh, this looks much bigger online. Um, the pictures. So this is eucalyptus. I like to put the oils in my oil diffuser at the shop. And I'm going to do the dropper because that'll help me measure better. Oh, oh, it's in plastic. Okay, I'm just going to take it to the shop like this. That was in that one. That one thing was in that little box. On to the next. I need to take the clothes from Fashion Nova. I got it just all laying on the floor on side of me. And I really need to move it. I had it in the middle of the floor in the middle of the room. And I moved it over here to this corner because I kept accidentally stepping on it. So I moved it to the corner. And now I keep rolling over it. I 
was most excited about this package. Like, not gonna lie, I am excited about the shelves and stuff that I'm gonna put on the wall. But this is really what I was excited about the most. So I got a new book. Lexi said at her conference that after she finished reading this book is when she felt called to create the women's conference, the Cultivate conference that she had back in April. So I want to read this book. This is gonna be the next book I'm reading. I'm actually gonna start it today. Like, I can't wait. Let me see how many pages it is. Yes, I'm so excited to read this book. It's only 201 pages. This is so short. I'm going to read this book. I'm starting it today. Next, I got this stand i'm gonna link everything down below y'all in my amazon but i got where is, okay. i got this stand for my phone so when i'm sitting like either at this desk or at my little vanity area i can set my phone up and have a better angle and because right now i just be leaning it against the vanity i always buy black and white everything so i say you know what i'm gonna get pink in my beauty room i'm putting pink this is cute and it's very sturdy i don't have to worry about my phone falling like this at all or like just dropping my phone so cute i love that oh i was gonna say what the heck is this this is a fake eucalyptus plant y'all <laughs> i'm gonna put this on my shelf that's going on the wall. This will be the only thing. No, I'm lying. I bought two things to go on it. Yep. I don't know what else I'm going to put on it. Y'all comment some suggestions down below. And every time I've been telling y'all to comment this or that to let me know something, y'all never do it. But I still be continuing to say it because I just be hoping one day someone is just going to listen and give me a suggestion about something. But yeah, this is gonna look cute up there. Cute little you can lift this plant. So this, obviously y'all see I've been doing my hair content. Y'all see that I've been doing my hair content and I've been consistent. So I got these little bowls. I'm so late to the hype about the bowls. But I do think that they are really, really cute. Oh. Really cute colors that they know that girls really like. They put it here twice. Like there's two pink ones and there's two white ones. And I believe they're oh this is navy. Is it too black? Yeah, and it's too black. So cute. I'm gonna use these. I don't know what kind of hairstyle I'm gonna do to use these, but I'm gonna use them sometime soon. I may use it before this video comes out. May not. I don't know. Probably will though. I don't know. Because I'm talking about trying to post this video Wednesday. Today is Monday. Y'all, if it's Wednesday and y'all seeing this video, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be so freaking proud of myself. But yeah, on to the next. This is heavy. Oh yeah, this is going to the shop. Oh, this is way heavier than I expected it to be. So I'm trying to do a, oh my gosh, okay. Oh my gosh, this is so heavy. What? Why is it so heavy? The card reader's at the shop. I'm gonna show y'all this when I go to the shop. Okay, this is a wall piece for it and a wire. I guess it's so heavy so that it can be weighed down and people can't easily pull a card out and fall or something. I don't know. I'll figure it out when we get to the shop. I'm going to leave this in the box. I'm having a really slow moment. I got a microphone. We're going to discuss why later. What is this? Oh. <laughs> Yo, I just be buying stuff. And like, when I'm buying it, I'll be like, oh yeah, I need this. I, I'm going to use this this time, that time. I'm gonna use it for X, Y, and Z. And then like when it's coming in, my reactions when I be opening it, I be like, what the heck? And then that's when I be realizing like, girl, you just be buying buku stuff. I 
I be seeing girls and stuff on like other YouTube videos and TikToks and Reels and all that stuff. And I be like, oh my gosh, that is so cute on her. I think that would look cute on me. So I buy it. I go to Amazon. I know I can find it on Amazon always. And I buy it. I'm not going to open this one. Because really, I want to use the pink. And I want to use the white. But like this, the Sky Haven, so freaking cute. I love it. Pink, black, white, and gray. I like all of them. They're all cute. And I'm going to wear all of them. I cannot wait. What is this? Oh, this is another oil for the shop. This is lavender. Yeah, lavender. This is the last box. And this is the last thing to go on the shelf. Oh my, this is not the last box. This is the last box in this box. That's what I mean. So this is like a, a vase. I don't know what I'm gonna put in it. But it's a cute vase. So this box, I'm gonna move the cubicles that's like placed behind me and I'm gonna put uh, these in them. These are bins, organized bins. The packaging is extremely beautiful. Is this the right size that I bought? Oh, yeah, okay, I gotta build it. Oh, heavy. I guess I can just move the stuff now. Whoa. Does that fit? Yes, it does perfectly. My camera's going dead, but I'm going to move these two. I swear that was so unnecessary for my camera to do. Like it really didn't have to just cut off in the middle of me talking while I was trying to hurry up. But anyways, these two are going onto each side of my vanity. Um, it's gonna be blocking the plugs and just like all of the wire junk that's about to be accumulated in that area. Um, and this hookah, I don't even smoke hookah. This is going by my sister. I do not want this. She been asking for it. The room has kind of become a mess, but this what we're working with, and I think it's cute. I think it is so freaking cute. I love it. I love it. Yes, I'm excited. So now, even if I'm gonna film from like this view right here, we still have a cute. Girl, I don't know why I put that lamp over there. I might take it out of here. I don't know but i wanted to bring my full body mirror and put it in here also i may put it in this corner over here but i really think it's too small to go right there i think i mean i think the corner is too small for the mirror to go there but this is what the room is looking like let me show y'all and this chair i'm probably you know what the chair is probably what i'm gonna move over there and or i might put the chair in this corner i'm probably gonna put the chair in this corner and maybe try to squeeze the mirror over there but that's a job for tonight because it's about to be time for me to be leaving to go to work um yes yeah, see i need to take that stuff from right there i'm gonna move that tonight as well this also i told myself that i was gonna fill this up with my hair products but i'm unsure about that but i'm more than likely probably going to end up filling it with my hair products i need to reorganize um over there also we're gonna get it together when i get off later right now though i gotta get up out here yo so i set it up I put my little square reader in there. I didn't plug it up yet. Because I'm not about to use it. And I need to get... My bad. I got a mint in my mouth. <laughs> okay, cool. So, yeah. It's plugged up. And this is why it has the weight. And the weight has a magnet in it, I believe. If I'm not tripping. Something is like pulling it to this. Well, it can't be a magnet because this is wood. 
I don't know. But this is really cute. This is going to be really convenient. Just going to put it like this. Now I'm going to turn straight. So yeah, I'm just going to leave it there. And I'm going to be setting up my iPad like probably right there. I brought it with me today even though I'm not about to use it. Just in case one of my clients wants to pay with a card and use that. I have my iPad but I didn't bring like the thing that I set it on. Hello, hello, hello to all my internet besties. Your girl is back. I went to work, did my two clients, and then I maybe or maybe not went shopping. I just went to the mall and I went to Ulta. I didn't do nothing too much. You know? Nothing too crazy, nothing too crazy. And of course, it wouldn't be right if I didn't show y'all what I got right. So, went to Ulta and I got another hourglass concealer because the shade that I used when I did my makeup yesterday, it was a cool shade. Like, I felt like it was very close to my skin tone, but it wasn't, it wouldn't be a good shade for me to highlight with. So, I went back and got a shade that I feel like I could do my under eye highlighting with. So, that shade that I had was 7.5 Doom. Okay, and this is 5.5 .5 Apricot. You know, they usually always say go up two shades. It's, that's exact, like, go up two shades. So, this is apricot. And I can't wait to try it next time I do my makeup. Yeah, this is a big difference from doing. That's what I was trying to see in Ulta. So this is Dune at the top and then Apricot on bottom. Perfect combo. So next, oh y'all, I never even showed y'all what else I went pick up earlier. When I went get my packages from downstairs, I also went, um, my work shirts were ready. So I went pick those up. I don't even know if I told y'all that I was starting to wear a work uniform. I just hate not looking, I don't know, professional. I feel like I don't be looking professional. I just be looking like who did it and why. Like however I feel and however much time I have and however far I am from the time I need to do laundry depends on how I'm going to work. And I need to stop presenting myself like that because my I don't present my business like that. So I need to stop presenting myself like that. So I'm doing scrubs, of course. I got them embroidered with my name and my logo. But I went to the alerts and I got some Uggs because I was trying to think my logic i was trying to think about um what shoes i'm wear with my scrubs like i've worn tennis shoes with them before and i mean it look cool or whatever but i would not prefer to wear tennis shoes so it's cool outside i was trying to get the clothes but it didn't have my size and the colors that i wanted it only had my size in the black and i didn't really want to get the black so i just went ahead and got these and i'm gonna start wearing these to work let me show y'all the shirts so I got two different colors because I need to do another business photo shoot. So obviously you're gonna be able to tell which one is for the business photo shoot. But I got black. Like this is so cute. And this is my sub logo. I never showed y'all. I never showed this logo. I don't think I ever really used it like talking about. I just got that and then I got my name. Oops, hope y'all can see Yeah, I got my name on the other side. So, super cute. I got all black shirt. This is cute. This is the other one. So, it's just the gray and white instead of the pink. And I think that this is super, super, super cute. This is so cute. This is going to look so cute on me. I'm excited. If you're in Baton Rouge or surrounding areas, come see me. Now, I'm about to get ready to put my shelves up on the wall. I'm finna um, open the box and stuff like that. And look for my tape measure. Basically, gather everything that I need so that I can put it up. I'm going to eat. And I think I'm going to wait to take a shower until after I put these, uh, put this stuff up. Tell me what you say now. Tell me what you say. You said that you would come again. You said that we would remain friends but you know that i do not depend on nothing or no one so why would you show up so uninvited just change my mind
mind like that Please don't take this personal But you ain't shit And you weren't special Till I made you so You better act like you know That I've been through worse to you Hey besties, let's get into it. I'm not keeping those pictures down now. I'm definitely moving it once I get up from here. But I'm gonna just call it a night. I need to show y'all the progress that I've made up in here now. Um, but after this, I'm gonna call it a night on the vlog and we're just gonna catch up in the next one. So, yeah. This is the shelving situation and obviously like, I didn't have a measuring tape. I thought I had my measuring tape here and I didn't. And I put the other one at the top too high and the bottom one couldn't go too much lower. So I decided I'm gonna put a picture right here and I'm gonna put another shelf like right there. I'm gonna bring it out a little bit to where it meets up with that one on the end. And it's gonna end like right up in there. So it's gonna be right there in the middle and I feel like that should be cool. Like if I put a picture or something at the bottom to like hide the distance of it, that should be cool. Then put another picture up there in the corner. I think that will look nice. I brought my mirror that was in the living room in here and then i moved the cubicles ain't it cute like it looks so freaking cute i need to organize my hair products on these sides because i told y'all that i'm gonna move my hair products into this but for now it's still right there because that's just another task for another day i moved my lights onto there and i think it is perfect so perfect absolutely love how this is looking it looks so freaking cute i love it y'all so i don't feel like making any dinner i am out for the night because i just want to start editing my video um this video right here i need to continue editing it uh so yeah let's just go ahead and wrap this vlog up i'm not cooking dinner i am going to domino's and get a pizza and a little pasta bowl don't judge me but yeah y'all if you stayed this long, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Leave me some suggestions for what y'all feel like I should do up in this room. I keep asking y'all, and like I was telling y'all, y'all never comment every time when I be asking, what should I do, what should I do, what should I do, what do y'all suggest? So I'm really looking forward to you all's comments in this video, because I know y'all not going to let me down again. I hope. And we'll see each other in the next one. Bye.